Well, welcome back to commentary, Queen Evil Fluffy. For those yes. of you just joining us, welcome to uh, this top six match. Top I don't know six. math. Yes, yeah. welcome to this top six match of Pokin at Evo 2019. We're about to join Utah and every damn day right here, now, supposedly this, live. This is a, uh, well, it's not live. Yeah, no, that's why I said supposedly. Okay. Uh, this, this matchup is definitely in Ed's favor. He can go through most of the projectiles. Oh, looks like we missed the fade, but all right, that's fine. All righty. Just kind of uh, getting around slowly. Utah able to avoid all hits so far. This is a very bright stage. It is a bright stage. Especially on this monitor, which does not appreciate the sand. All right. Utah keeping it safe, throwing out as many projectiles as possible. Oh, very nice counter dash. Okay. Throwing out the Frogadier. Doesn't actually use it in the in any of his hits, but the JY is able to catch Utah. Double counter. Ooh, approaching JY. Oh, but he resets very, the grab. Very nice. Good mix up there from Ed. Or sorry, grab to, gra to counter the counter. I got words. Very nice, got out of the knockoff. Especially how much uh, Utah depends on burst. Knockoff uh, would definitely help out Ed. Yeah, okay. Oh, he's able to catch one of the guys, but doesn't follow up with the JX. Utah teleporting around, messing up the camera. Put us in his perspective for a minute. Oh, yeah. Gotta love those teleport. Uh... You know, the camera does not approve of teleports. It's Ever. kind of funny. Ooh, able to Again. leap over, but he still what? gets caught by the 6x. Strong punish there from Utah. Not quite able to take it, but Ed is, Ed is down to 23 HP. Throwing out a burst from as far away as possible. And not he, the time was there. Ed saw the time and just stopped. Yeah, I figure at that point, it's obvious that uh, Gardevoir's too far. There's no way she can approach that fast. I mean, with Togekiss, you could. Maybe, but... Uh, that ain't Toga kiss I'm seeing in the corner there. I mean, on that corner. Oh, getting hit by the ice and the optimals. Taking away that. Oh. Just losing so much burst now. All right, using Frogadier for the shield country. Able to catch another multiple friends. Resets of the Fury Swipes. Doesn't get the last hit, though. Counterattacks. Okay, big okay. trade. Big. And resets with, uh, I believe that's Charge X. Uh, definitely getting inside of Utah's head now. Definitely don't first. Just try to see what you can do here. Yep. Oh, and Utah's able to get caught by the ice super crash. All right, we're heading to a game three. It looks like uh, Ed figured out what what Utah's about, how to counter him. Yep, got another frog here, but the JY's able to catch him before anything comes out. Got a psychic from Utah. Counter attacks. Oh, but it's a... Uh, night Slash. Yes, the Night Slash is able to catch him. Honestly, it's such a cool move, but it's so frustrating to fight against. But that's why it's so great. Alrighty. Knocking him in, taking all the chip damage possible, and Ooh. getting... Ooh. Able to uh, counter pierce him and get a strong follow up there. Very Ooh. nice uh, 8x catching him. Yeah, no kidding. And, uh, and I'm kind of surprised that caught him. Yeah, it's not exactly an anti-air. All right, Dazzling Gleam, not able to avoid Frogadier's attacks, came out too soon. And getting the knockoff on it. All right, uh, Ed declaring burst. So Utah is Utah. declaring burst. All right, Utah, keeping his distance once again. Used his stored power charges. He's going to have to build those back up before he can use them again, you know, meaningfully. Ooh, oh, able to catch with a 6x. Burst is oh, going to hit. Oh, that's not going to connect. No, I don't think he realized he was going to face shift there. Probably thought he reset his face shift points. Light hit's almost not enough to deal with the counter, but the uh, JX is. Oh, that is. Oh. oh, my goodness. And Ed takes the first game. Oh, that was so close. Strong work there with Fury Swipes. All right. We'll see if we're going to just, all right. No, looks he's like, going back in. Yep, we're going right back he, in. He's not bringing in the Libre. Neither of them is going to change. I was expecting sport change, if anything, but nothing works, too. All right. Okay, Utah gets caught by the ice. 
Ed not quite able to capitalize, and Utah grabs him after the CADC. Smart choice there. Trying to pre uh, preemptively uh, stop a jump didn't quite work out, but the counter combo, that's more than enough. Smart now choice there. Yep. Oh, gets like caught that. by more ice. And Ed able to capitalize on it nice and hard. All right. Utah, see it, seeing it. Gets caught by the frog deer. He was trying to dash in and grab. All right. Keeps that distance away. Throws on an energy ball. Smart choice is the 2x. Teleports pass and hits him with the JX, catching any approach that Ed would have prepared. Catching the jump, CADC. Nope, no CADC. Just fully charged counter. Oh, oh, that's the CADC. Cancel into grab. That was that was probably the best choice of options I ever. Absolutely smart choice there from Utah. Able to punish what had clearly been a taunt he'd been going for for quite a while now. Oh, gets thing. caught by more ice. Full follow up. Utah no longer has burst active at the moment. Can't be an option. Okay, we'll counter, but Weavehouse comes out sooner. Icicle loops? Nope. Uh, unfortunately, whiffs the JX. Utah's CAD Singh gets caught by another Icicle crash, though, right up against the wall. It's a rough place to be against Weavile, if I'm oh, being yeah. honest. Weavile on the wall is a very dangerous character. All right, uses the counter, falls and into the ice. ice. Oh, oh that's unfortunate. Locks Frog Deer, able to get around uh, the grab, but unfortunately gets punished for it. Got to be careful with that second hit from Frog Excellent work there. Look at that. That is half his health bar gone. Yes, Rocky. He has burst. All right. Catherine flips him with the Icicle Crash. Utah declaring burst to match up. Oh, gets caught by the homing attack. All right. See what's gonna happen here. Okay, Ed declares first. I think, okay, Utah State and Shield. Smart choice there. De uh, uses his own first attack. I don't, oh, that clipped him, but not enough. Utah's now spent long enough uh, not getting hit to recover all of his recoverable HP. Oh, look at that pressure, the no button pressure from Weavile. Able to grab him right as he counters. Oh, Utah trying to play it safe, but that icicle is too close. If he were to drop shield, his arm would drop down and freeze him. Oh, and Ed wins by timeout. I guess it's revenge for that first game. Must be. All right, All right. so this is uh, match point four, Ed. Absolutely. Utah still has the potential to bring this back, but he's going to have to work hard for it. Okay, able to catch him with the JY. That's going to be a strong start for him. He definitely has to go first quick. That was a brave move to use taunt there. Oh, he gets punished hard. Fury Swipe's not able to get the last hit again. It doesn't uh, properly mix up Utah. Unfortunately, Utah's able to get around it. And he's taking away all of that synergy that Utah works for. Yep. All right, counters to avoid the frog deer. 8x to shove every damn day into the corner. Ooh, oh 6x, goodness. that's gonna hurt. A lot of damage here. Ooh, able to get the full combo off the wall bounce. Smart choice and there from Utah. Oh, Ed walks burst. into the ice. Oh my goodness. Gets caught by a homing attack. Oh, but he gets thrown off by the fully charged hit. Very nice. Good uh, counter there. there. He has synergy now. Yep, Ed is now down to 36 HP. We'll see. Oh, oh. and the energy ball catches him. That Utah tying it up one to one. Catch. I don't. I think he just thought it would hit a couple frames earlier. He looks just as shocked as we are in the corner. Yeah. <laughs> that was definitely a, a weird clipping. Okay. All right, and here we are going into game three. Utah proving he's not off the board yet. He wants that top four just as much as Ed does. Now, let's see. This is the game that decides it. Will Utah choke like he did last year, or will he manage to get over that? The world may never know, except they totally will as soon as this match is over. Yep. That's kind of how time works. Okay, Utah not getting for. Oh, oh, never mind. I spoke too soon. I apologize I for the, the commentator curse. Against okay. your own people. 
Utah trying to be patient, but Ed putting on the pressure, able to catch him. Strong counterattack there. Oh. Utah tries to see ADC grab, but it comes out too soon. Okay, and Ed with the grab. Ed's almost got first. He's definitely going to, to need that when Utah oh, does he's something got it crazy. Now. Utah tried to read a rightward dash, I'm assuming. Okay, able to block the ice, which means it's not going to be a threat, but unfortunately... That's extremely minus, and that's oh. the game. Yeah, that might be. Yeah, that's the round. I can never tell with Weavile. His, his grab is so weak. His grab and his burst is extremely weak, but... They're still time. useful when they're needed, and that's what matters. Ooh, Very the nice dazzling gleam. gleam. That's a he strong start for Utah. Now. All right, teleporting over. Ooh, oh, able to goodness, catch him with the four wide. Oh, I think they both, okay. Oh no, it didn't punish. Didn't, yeah, unfortunately, too far away for the 6x to punish. Tried for the match to leave, but unfortunately, Ed is able to counter through it. Utah no longer has burst. Frog it's gonna be out. rough for him. Oh, gets caught by the charge X. Full Fury swipes against the wall. Counter attack if Utah will get through, but okay. He's able to stay safe. Uh, Very, with the, what? Okay, and we turn around mid charge, why not? All right, using Jirachi, Swap. using that extra uh, defense and attack buff in order to help him out in this pressure situation. Oh, but, but it's not helping grab. him too much. It'll keep him alive for a little bit, but it is. Ooh, okay. Oh, okay, he's able to deal back. with the grab. Smart use of the homing cancel. All right, using uh, first attack. It's not going to hit. Agility. Nope, just shield it. Oh, the oh, clash. Unfortunately, Utah's oh, still at the synergy free. debuff. He's now equaled out. Oh, good counter there. Oh my goodness, this is extremely close. Okay, he catches him with the 6 doesn't but follow it wasn't up. enough. This is the follow-up. Dazzling Gleam, Ed is able to block it. Oh, oh and the stored power goodness. able to take stored the round. Reaching. We are officially on a match point. This is match point for both players. This will be the deciding factor right here and right uh, now. Utah used a special cheer, so he already has a good bit of burst there. Yep, all right. He's going for the burst crystals. This time he's keeping his distance, able to go underneath the ice. That's going to be a big step right there. And caught him with the back wide. All right. Ooh, oh, tried to get trick. over him, but the energy, the little energy ball is able to catch him. Popping burst to just get as much damage off right now. This is yep. Ed's time. Okay, he declared burst. I, I, okay, Utah State and Shield couldn't tell. It's able nice to grab, grab him. Smart option there from Utah. Well. Ed has been getting away with a lot of charging grabs. Yeah, it's true. All right, able to block the icicle crash. Tried to counter, oh, but unfortunately, Homie is able to catch the vulnerable frames. Okay, declaring burst doesn't want any of that. It is Utah's turn. Okay, it's six X able to catch him. Goes right into burst attack. Smart this, choice. This, this probably will not be enough. All right, Tuck's our professional uh, number guesser says thirty or forty. Fifty-three. 53. Close now. Oh, able grab. to get into the grab. This is, this and Utah get, takes oh the set goodness. two and to the one. Pop -off is just, Utah does not look okay. You can't see him 